All right, here we go, guys. This is my 2005 V8 4.7 litre manual Land Cruiser it's up for sale. Unfortunately, she has to go. Run around and quick, do a quick few features. ARB ball bar, worn 1200 pound winch. The winch has been unraveled twice. Um, spotlights, wide beam, spread beam, fog lights. Under the bonnet, dual batteries. Um, very beautifully wired in. Previous owner was an oil electrician. LPG gas injection, extractors, full exhaust, uh, Exceedy power chip, isolator for the winch, so no one can come and plug in and try and damage your winch or damage your car with it. Sorry, colour coded safari snorkel, tinted windows, guards. Roof rack, it's had a two and a half inch suspension lift, uh, max lift with high quality components, running all terrains with 95% tread, Lexus alloys, walk around the other side. As you can see, it's in beautiful condition, very sad to see it go. Tinted windows, Rhino roof racks, 80 litres on board LPG. Uh, rock sliders, removable wheel carrier, take that off, I normally have that off, uh, reversing camera, all extra seats are in, interior is practically untouched, uh, heavy duty tow kit, plugs, all that's there, it's got airbags if you're towing to, it's got airbag suspension in the back so you can pump it up, if you look in the back here, furniture and seats are in perfect condition, uh, if you've got kids, dual DVD headrests that also plug straight through into the upgraded GPS, it's a bit dark in here, um, that's got GPS, Bluetooth, uh, external connections, everything you can need, um, upgradable maps, all your four-wheel drive maps can go on it, got all the manuals and books for that, got the manuals and the books for these as well, they come with uh, controllers for kids, so you've got games, uh, Bluetooth headsets, so they don't just don't have to listen to their games. External rear power, 12 volt in the back, fog lights and spotlights controls are there. It's got 162,000 on it. Uh, upgraded interior, UHF radio, um, there's the remote for the front winch, also I think it's in the glove box at the moment, is the manual winch cable, still all the factory books, um, USB and iPhone connectivity for the head unit, so TV, SD, nav, auxiliary, iPod, reads, DVDs, VCDs, pretty much does everything you could ever want it to do. Uh, beautiful manual, had a new clutch put in it when I got it about oh, 12,000 k's ago. Um, Handbrake works beautifully. A uh, new windscreen was put in a couple of thousand k's ago. I did have to take the tint off the front two windows because the cop said it was too dark. So, a little bit of difference between the two windows. So I'm going to go around and get that done, but I've got a part with it now. Um, I'm just going to give it a bit of a, a bit of a rev. One of the great things about this V8 is the noise. So full chip, exhaust, extractors. Um, only thing it really needs after that could be a supercharger, but um, it's got plenty of go. Leaves diesels for dead. Uh, we did a comparison, we drove this to Adelaide, towing a trailer with my dad towing a trailer with his turbo diesel. Uh, we worked out that I was six cents a kilometre cheaper to run my V8 on gas with the liquid injected gas than it was to drive my dad's diesel over and back. So uh, definitely a good economy car, great power, drives well, drives like a sedan, beautiful looking car. If you've got any questions? Give me a call.